Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome on board of my project which I actually had to freeze for the winter time. Nothing would really stick nicely and uh, it would probably, if it sticks then it would fall off when it gets warm. I had this experience with my minivan when I was working, I had to redo certain things. But the video is not really about the van, the video is about um, my new addition to a camping gear. And it's the heater right here. It's a butane heater I was looking at for a while. And I was just wondering, is it safer? I wouldn't say actually that it produces more heat than the propane heaters like body um, or little body or big body doesn't matter but this one is smaller actually so it's the heater right here it runs on butane and uh, let me show you that's the butane cylinder you can buy in a camping store or even online uh, this is Coleman they were on sale at Walmart so I bought three of this but usually I buy them from in Brooklyn a Chinese store they go for um, I think four for five dollars and uh, they're good they're no difference it's the same butane it burns <laughs> okay what I like about this heater actually it comes with this adapter which screws into here and um, what happens when you want to use something bigger than, rather than this little propane, I mean butane cylinder cartridge. You use a bigger one, which you put the hose on the, on the other end and screw on here, which gives you opportunity to run longer on the bigger capacity cylinders or tanks. So let's uh, start it up. I loaded the... Uh, cartridge already and what you do you just pull the lever down and it brings cylinder into the connection with the valve then what you do this is the uh, ring over here when you pull it it's like a choke it releases more fuel in this case so I don't need it because I already pre-run it but when you pull it it basically ignites better so we're just gonna we're just gonna twist the handle and it's just like any butane stove you click and the spark flies and gas ignites and produces this amount of heat as I said um, of course no matter what you run uh, to heat up the space unless it's um, some kind of safe but I don't trust in anything not, not a butane, not a propane, not even electric heat. Um, so I use carbon monoxide detector, I use smoke detectors. You saw my uh, minivan, it's all equipped with it. Okay, uh, let me show you around, it's still the same as the speakers. I replaced the speakers totally. Radio is still there, but I purchased another one with a connection for rear view camera. We're gonna do video on it a little bit later. Of course, there's a mess with electrical, still a big mess. I have to pre-wire the uh, LED lights. I got a whole set of LED lights for the van. So I need to just uh, figure out how I'm gonna do it. Um, that's the door for the cabinet, which uh, is not gonna go back in, it's ugly. <laughs> it's from uh, last century design. That's the shelf, which uh, will be a little bit larger after I finish. Maybe I can put somebody to sleep here. <laughs> Some of our unwelcomed guests. Okay, and it's uh, it's getting warm on the top because, as you all know, the heat rises up. The temperature here shows 48 degree, and this side it's it has a magnetic piece over here so you can do the clip on so let's put it here okay let's see how it's gonna go 
Oh, humidity is higher on the top than on the bottom. Okay. Uh, also, to move the uh, air around, I found that old battery operated uh, fan in my garage. So let's start it up. Gonna do it. Gonna turn it on. And just have it going here. Perhaps it will do some work. Oh, and we can see there, it's getting warmer. It's already 50 degrees. I'm gonna put it on hold and we will return in a few minutes to see how it's going. Okay, some time passed by, uh, maybe less than a half an hour. Tem temperature on board went 59 degree and it was original what 48 i guess so it raises up pretty nicely it feels nice and warm the carbon monoxide detector didn't go up off at all and it's you know it's just uh, nice and warm it doesn't smell bad in here so this was a little review on this wonderful uh, butane heater which actually can keep you very very warm inside of the small spaces remember this thing is huge and fill it up with the heat requires a lot of uh, work so it does the job it's not terribly cold outside when it's really cold outside you may want something bigger but for a nice comfortable 60 degree it would be good all right we're going to be back soon.